Hello, and welcome to COVID Facts in 5, your comprehensive look at St. Lucia's management and mitigation of the novel coronavirus. I'm Homer Mark. The Ministry of Health and Wellness in the past year has been using contact tracing methods to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Contact tracing is the process of identifying, assessing, and managing people who have been exposed to a disease to prevent onward transmission. Contact tracing can break the chains of transmission and stop the virus. It is an essential public health tool for controlling infectious disease outbreaks like COVID-19. Government has invested in an app for that very purpose. Systems analyst in the Health Information Management Unit, Kevin Harris, tells us more. The contact tracing app helps the ministry in its contact tracing by first allowing individuals to upload the data from their phones, which would include all the locations that they have been in in the last 14 days. The reason for this is that normally human beings may not necessarily remember where they have been in the last 14 days. Also, remember that as somebody being contact traced, you are under a lot of stress. You may have just been informed that you have been diagnosed with a certain disease and this may cloud your memory. So the contact tracing app helps by keeping track of those places and allowing the ministry to have factual information as to where you have been in the last 14 days. The contact tracing app is absolutely free. The contact tracing app is available in both the Apple stores and Google Play stores. All you need to do is search for 758 Care Alert. St. Lucia's very own Harvard University graduate and researcher Khalil Luizi served as the project consultant. Remember, the app is not designed to invade privacy, not collect or transfer your information. Join us next time for another COVID Facts in 5. I'm Humidi Mark.